Hintayin lang natin sandali. <clears throat> so I'm planning to discuss terpenes today, you know. Tapos pag may time pa, we'll, we'll try to discuss photosynthesis. <clears throat> so yung, yung terpenes, um, these, are the, ano, these are the major constituents of essential oils, you know. These are natural products. <clears throat> Tapos, um, it's included in biochemical engineering kasi nga siguro plants yung nagpo-produce, ano? naturally occurring. You can, you can find this in, if, you're, if you have the MRI reviewer, makikita nyo medyo, they devoted some pages ano? uh, regarding terpenes. <clears throat> so kasi ganun yung, ano, yung biochemical engineering. Pag hindi nila matrace, kung saan, ba may lumabas sa board exam, tapos hindi nila matrace kung saan nilalagay, <clears throat> tapos uh, biological products, so nilalagay nila sa biochemical engineering. O kaya dun pumasok yung terpenes. <clears throat> And siguro pwede na, ano? 17. I'm going to share my PowerPoint. Okay. Okay, so terpenes, uh, these are the major components of essential oil. So I, I hope you're familiar with essential oils. Siguro naman bago mag-pandemic, you're able to do your uh, steam distillation. Ano, nagdala kayo ng mga plant materials. Have you done that in organic chemistry? Uh, distillation, steam distillation, and then your, your product is essential oil. So ang major component ng essential oil are terpenes. So as you can see, as we discuss this, uh, makikita nyo probably kung anong mga terpenes yung extract nyo. Okay, so terpenes are large and diverse class of organic compounds produced by a variety of plants, particularly conifers. So yung mga conifers, yung mga pine trees. Ano? Though also by some insects such as termites or swallowtail butterflies, they also emit terpenes. So hindi lang siya sa plants. Meron din, as, as we discuss this, makikita nyo meron din Uh, mga terpenes na napuproduce ng insects. Ano? So the difference between terpenes and terpenoids is that terpenes are hydrocarbons, no? carbon and hydrogens only, and then whereas terpenoids contain the additional functional group. Ibawa, may mga carbonyl carbon, may mga terpenoids, ano? merong mga hydroxy. So that's the difference between terpenes and terpenoids. <clears throat> so they are major components of resin and or turpentine. Ano? Have you heard of turpentine? So organic chem namin nun, may, may ganitong experiment, di ba? You have a petri dish, tapos may turpentine oil, tapos uh, your turpentine oil is liquid, no? tapos parang we, we pour that in the, in, the, ano, in, the pit, in the watch glass, tapos we, we let it dry under the fume hood, and then after some time, pag, pag malapit na matapos yung lab namin, We observe it and then you have a solid, you know, you have a solid material on the watch glass. Kasi explanation doon, nag-evaporate nag na yung kanyang mga vapor constituent. Tapos yung may iwan, actually parang may reaction, you know, wherein, wherein you form the, the solid product. So ganun din, actually ganun din yung ano, ganun din yung technology ng paints, di ba? When you apply paints sa so umpisa, di ba, liquid yun. Pero as it dries, it becomes solid. So, doon nang galing yung technology ng paint. Ano paint sa turpentine? <clears throat> so, in addition to their rules as end products in many organisms, terpenes are major biosynthetic building blocks within nearly every living creature. <clears throat> so, alimbawa, yung steroids. Have you heard of steroids? So, hindi, medyo, medyo, ano, no, medyo, kasi kulang yung biochemistry natin. So, aside from the energy, ano, energy, biochemical pathways. Mer marami pa 'yan, 'di ba? Yung mga psychological, meron pa yung mga physiological, no? At, at pro probably you have heard na yung happiness natin, chemical 'yan, no? Chemical 'yan, 'di ba? 
yung mga endorphin, so mga chemical siya. Ano? So doon kasama yung steroids. Ano? So steroids, for example, are derivative of triperpene isqualine. So pag sinabing triterpene, uh, 30, ano? 30 carbon terpenes. So isqualine. Probably you have heard of this supplement ng isqualine. Ano? So from isqualine, yan yung nagiging steroids. No, parang pag sinabing on steroids, parang medyo hyper, di ba? Di ba pag, pag sinabing, ah, nagtitake yan ng steroids, eh, yan, ba, muscle building, di ba? Parang yan, no? <clears throat> so, medyo mas malayo-layo pang ano, no? Kasi nakita nyo naman siguro yung stryer. I don't know. You got to get to see the physical book. Para siyang ano, probably if you've seen Atkins, di ba? Or Scoob. You're familiar with those books. Yung mga hardbound ng Atkins. So, ganun din kalaki yung, ano, yung Strayer. Parang mga 3, 3 to 5 ano, thick. Tapos malalaki talaga ng libro. <clears throat> The glossy type. Ano? So, terpenes and terpenoids are primary constituents of essential oils as I've mentioned previously. Ano? of many types of plants and flowers, okay? So essential oil are used widely as fragrances in perfumery. So malaking industry din yan, ano? Aside from Parma, oh, ngayon kasi marami ng, ano, eh, marami ng ibang industry, ano? Di ba, meron ng apple, tapos meron, meron kayong mga oil, yan, malalaki din yan, tapos Parma. <clears throat> so malaking industry din ng fragrances, ano? And in medicine, and alternative medicine such as aromatherapy. So, terpenes yung bida doon, ano? Di ba? Pag you're, you're, you're using that, yung mga, yung nabibili sa Shopee, di ba? Yung mga nagdadrop kayo ng essential, sisasaksak nyo and then magiging mabango na, ano? So, di ba nakikita nyo yung mga, isang konsep na yung essential oil, ano? Meron ganyan sa uh, Andalwood, mga ganun, ano? So, generally, those are so vitamin A is terpene, no? medicine, di ba? So hindi lamang yung mga essential oil, pati yung mga vitamin A, nakikita nyo mga mga terpenes din. The aroma and flavor of hops, okay? Very familiar with hops. So ito yung isang major ingredients in, 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 ano, in, in making beers. So kahit nang sabihin nyo pa, hindi kayo umiinom ng beer. Um, it's most uh, malaki malaki yung nakoconsume ano malaking amount ng beer yung nakoconsume annually so ang ang ginagawa kasi ng beer diba yung yung grains ano yung grains it's, it's a fermentation process pero yung nag add ng flavor dun sa after fermenting the grains is the hops so yung kaya nag add ng flavor yung hops kasi marami siyang terpenes so meron siyang mercin penin ano Cariopelin at saka Ayomolin. Ganun ka, ano, ganun ka, uh, ka widespread yung use ng, ano, no, ng terpenes, as you can see. From medicine to, to beers, ano, to perfumes, no? so merong terpenes. Okay, so isoprene, this is the building block of terpenes. So as you can see, this is a five carbon compound. So one, two, three, four, five. This is known as isoprene. <clears throat> so this is the building block. Parang ito yung monomer niya, ano? So from here, as you can see, you, you, you can, you can, maraming possibilities, no? Maraming iba't ibang structure ng, ng terpenes. So this is the isoprene. <clears throat> so this is the isopentyl pyrophosphate. You have the pyrophosphate, di ba dalawang phosphate na magkaduktong, ano? that's the pyrophosphate. So this is your uh, isoprene. So we, we call this compound isopentyl pyrophosphate. So this is a naturally occurring uh, chemical component. Ano? So yung isopentyl pyrophosphate and then the other one is dimethyl allyl pyrophosphate. So this is the other form of your isoprene. So yung isa nandun sa kabilang dulo, yung pyrophosphate, ito nandun sa kabilang end. Ano? We're going to compare the two. Ito may double band doon. And then this one is, and dito lang yung double band. Pero both of them are ano, five carbon, ano? five carbon compound. <clears throat> so, 
this this two combine to form the other pentin so uh, terpene sorry the MAPP at saka yung uh, IPP combine combine, uh, combine to form the different forms of ano terpenes okay so kaya kaya yung terpenes yung number of carbon nila ay multiple of 5 because of the isoprene ano so kaya meron tayong hemiterpene pag hemiterpene 5 carbons tapos monoterpene yung monoterpene naman 10 tapos merong 15 carbon na terpenes 20 25 30 okay <clears throat> So meron tinatawag na head to tail attack mechanism in in forming longer chain of terpenes ano So this is the head to tail attack Tandaan niyo pa organic chem So this is the DMAPP What can you say ano to SN1 SN2 So DMAPP tapos yung pyrophosphate is a very good living group So ano to SN1 SN2 so pag pag alis nung pyrophosphate you have a positive charge you have a carbocation right here no iniwan niya yung carbon so positive yung carbon natin and then it is attacked by a neighboring ipp this is your dmapp ano na naging carbocation tapos this is attacked by the uh, pi band no the electron in the pi band to form to form your long chain ano the 10 carbon uh, terpene ito na yun ano <clears throat> tapos yun, siyempre magkakaroon ng positive charge and then uh, the electron chain moves there so nagkaroon ng double band, you know? And then the, 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 ano, a base, a base will get the hydrogen in this carbon in order to form the double band right here. No? <clears throat> so ito yung ito yung mechanism ng ano ng formation ng GPP. This is ger geranyl pyrophosphate, ano? Ito yung, ito yung nasa robes na essential oil. Actually, pa, paulit-ulit lamang yung ganun. Ano? So as you can see, limbawa, ganito yung form niya. Uh, this, this pyrophosphate can live and then magkakaroon na naman ulit ang carbocation. If there's a nearby IPP, magre-react na naman sila. So pahaba ng pahaba. So sabi ko nga sa inyo, merong mga terpenes na 30 carbon long. No? Okay, so these are the classification or classes of terpenes. Pag sinabing hemiterpenes, uh, 5 carbons. So example, syempre yung isoprene. Ano? Pag monoterpenes, 10 carbons. We have the myrcene. We're going to see the structure later. <clears throat> and then pag uh, 15, 15 carbons, you have the cisky terpene. Parang 1 and a half. Cisky means 1 and a half. 1 and a half. No? So you have the pyrnicine. Ano? And then... Uh, retinol. Retinol is your vitamin A. You know? So vitamin A is it contains 20 carbons and it's known as the titerpene, etc. You know? So basta by 10 yung bilang, you know? yung mono, di, at saka tri. Pag tri na, triterpene, 30 na yun. <clears throat> okay? So parnesyl pyrophosphate. <clears throat> Synthesis of terpene. So pwedeng, pwedeng alimbawa uh, yung dalawang yung dalawang cisketerpene each of them containing 15 carbons for example yung parnesyl pyrophosphate ano if they combine they will form a triterpene kasi if, if 15 plus 15 you get you're going to get 30 carbons ano so that's a triterpene and then yung geranyl geranyl pyrophosphate this means it has it contains 20 ano when you combine two geranyl geranyl pyrophosphate you're going to get geranyl geranyl pyrophosphate this is this is a 20 carbon terpene ano so diterpene yon no so if if this two combine yung dalawang diterpene the same passion as the isoprene dmapp mechanism yung head to tail ano lilib lamang yung pyrophosphate na atakihin nung uh, pi band nung electron no sa double band yung carbocation you're going to get a, a longer ano, longer chain terpene ano? so you have the geranyl geranyl pyrophosphate will be able to produce a c40 you know a tetraterpene <clears throat> so for example another example if you have geranyl pyrnicil this is 25 ano? kasi di ba yung pyrnicil 15 yung geranyl 10 <clears throat> so 25 yun, ano? 25 carbon so 
this is this this 25 is known as ano sister terpin or two and a half or parang half to three no in yung sister up to three so 25 yan no <clears throat> and then we have the polyterpenes yung yung rubber actually yung rubber yung natural natural rubber are terpenes I, I wonder siguro sa ano sa CPI niya na pag-aralan niyo yung di ba mayroong natural rubber <clears throat> yung yung gulong ng kotse hindi naman yun lahat ay synthetic pero may part din na ng synthetic di ba nakita ko lang ngayon sa ano mayroong nag mayroong nag PD ng uh, tires so parang ang sa rubber yung gulong ng ng sasakyan uh, basta significant component is natural and significant component is synthetic Kaya kaya hanggang ngayon buhay na buhay pa rin yung 'di ba nakikita niyo yung hindi ko alam kung ano yung discovery. Ine-extract pa rin yung yung latex, yung dagta ng mga rubber tree. Tapos yung pa rin yung component pa rin siya ng ginagawang gulong, ano? So they they, they formulated a combination para mas uh, desirable for for the desirable properties of the of the wheels, ano? <clears throat> Okay, so these are uh, common terpenes. Ano? So basically, bibilangin nyo lang kung anong carbon and then you will know the classification. So for example, uh, sa pine tree, if you're familiar with pine tree, ano, you, can, you can find pinin. Ano? So pinin, so pag binilang nyo yan, so six dun sa chain, tapos merong isang, isa dun sa ano, this one, so this is the seventh, eight, nine, so ten yan. Ano? This is a, this is a monoterpene, no? So, pinin is a monoterpene. You can you can find this in 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 pine trees, ano? Probably sa leaves. <clears throat> diba, you're, you're familiar naman pag nakapunta na ba kayong bagyo? Diba, iba yung amoy ng hangin? Doon na kasi marami silang pine tree. <clears throat> and then you have here the karyophyllene. So, this is peppercorn. Probably this is the or, your ordinary pepper. Sinong mahilig sa inyong gumamit ng pepper? Nagagawa ng mga palaman sa sandwich, ano? Yung mga hindi mahilig sa matamis, diba? So, they prefer... Probably tuna or egg sandwich, di ba? You're going to use uh, pepper, di ba? So yun, meron, meron yung, ano, meron yung uh, terpenes. <laughs> um, ako, I, I, ako, personally, hindi ko alam kung ano explanation eh, pero generally, it's I think it's healthy, ano? So sa UPL, because eh, meron, meron dung, ano, may restaurant dung, yung Herb Republic, ano? If you're familiar with Robinson, katabi lang nung, ano, katabi lang nung Robinson. Pero nasa labas siya. <clears throat> they, have, they have this dishes na ano, iba-iba yung mga ginagamit na na uh, uh, herbs. No? Marami silang ginagamit na herbs. Kasi pag, pag local cuisine kasi, di ba, ano lang ba yung ginagamit natin? Sibuyas. No? Sibuyas. Yung mga aromatics sa akin, parang limited eh. Sibuyas, bawang, ganun lang ano. Madalang pa nga tayong gumamit ng laurel. Ano? Laurel is, a, is an aromatics doon. Pero yun, yung restaurant sa LB, marami silang ginagamit. And then, parang ano, uh, of course, the food tastes good. Pero paglabas mo, parang ano, <laughs> you feel good, you know? You, parang, hindi ko alam kung psychological kasi I, I, I'm thinking of, of, of this terpenes as healthy thing. Ano? <clears throat> anyway, pag napunta kayo sa LB, itry nyo yung Herb Republic. Kala ko nga nung una dati, ano siya eh, parang, kasi pangalan niya Herb Republic, nung restaurant. Kala ko parang ano siya, parang bar. <laughs> Pero hindi pala, because it's Herb Republic, because they are offering, ano, adhesives na maraming ginagamit na herbs. Ano? <clears throat> of course, we have the karin, it's in rosemary, rosemary, sorry, rosemary, <laughs> rosemary, you know, you're familiar with rosemary chicken, yan, meron din yung rosemary chicken din, no? And then lemonine, of course, you can find this in your, in lemons, no? Lemonine. <clears throat> Ilan ba to? Ayan, probably 10 din to, ano? Kasi 6, 7, 8, 9, and then 10, ano? So this is a monoterpene. Lenolol. I think, I think all of these are, ano, ano? monoterpene. So kaya nyo, monoterpene ang dami-dami, ano? All of them are, contains, ano, 10, 10 carbon. Lenolol. So lenolol is, you can find this in mints and lavender. Yan. Lavender is ng pampatulog, di ba? Lalagay essential oil. <clears throat> essential oil. Um, 
The familiar with lavender, of course, mints, di ba? Yan yun naman yung mints. And then, terpinols, you can, you can find this in orange. Ano bang daladala nyo nung organic chem kayo, ano? So sa junipers, I'm not familiar with junipers. Pero sa orange yeah. daw, sa balat ng orange, you have terpinols. Parang terpin din talaga, ano? Of course, lemongrass. <clears throat> Tanglad to, ano? So you have nirol. So nirol is 10, ano rin yan, ano? Monoterpin din yan. Sa hops, these are hops. This is used in beer. So you have homolin, ano? So kita nyo, napakainik ng mga structures nila. <clears throat> geranial, you can find geranial in roses. Kaya lang, di ba, hindi, ano, napaka-sensitive ng geranial. Pag, pag inanin nyo siya, even, even steam distillation, you not, you're not going to recover uh, geranial, nasisira siya, ano? But you can also find this in, ano, in grapes, in wine, ano? And then mercine. You can, you can find mercine in cannabis, sa marijuana, and myrtles. Ito yung structure ng mercine. Ano? Kung gaano siya ka widespread, ano, yung terpenes. Okay, so this is, let's, let's talk about ano, monoterpenes. These are the 10... 10, ano, 10 carbon uh, terpenes. So monoterpenes are consist of two isoprene units and have the form molecular formula C10816. Now, the example of uh, monoterpenes and monoterpenoids includes geranule and terpenul. Ano? So terpenul is present in lilacs. I'm familiar with lilacs. Lemonin are present in ano, citrus fruits. So kung nagdala kayo ng orange, ng organic chem nyo, probably lemon yun yung na-extract nyo. Ano? <clears throat> Mercine are present in hops. So hops yun yung ginagamit sa beer. Ang, ang word exam kasi natin ay napaka... <laughs> so minsan ito yung tinatanong nila. Last time, yung last word nung... Ito itong nakaraan, ano? Yung nag-tap si Alex. Ang tinanong ay ano daw yung polymer ng, ano, ng bulletproof vest. <clears throat> okay? So ganun, ganun ka ano. Parang quiz contest siya. Hindi mo ina-expect yung mga tinatanong nila. Pero iba madali lang naman. Madali lang naman like empirical formula. Let's see if remember empirical formula. First order, uh, first order reactions. Balancing reaction. Ganun. Yung iba madali lang. <clears throat> okay, na-mention ko na ito kanina sa inyo. Yung lenalala, no? this is present in lavender. And then penin is present in pine trees. Okay, so these are, this is the mechanism ano, on how geranyl pyrophosphate, di ba remember geranyl pyrophosphate, ito yung 10 carbon na ano, no, na na-form uh, from the reaction of IPP and DMAPP. So ito na yung kasunod. Ano? So as you can see, paano ba siya nagiging lemonine? Ito yung lemonine. Ano? So, syempre, ganun ulit. Good living group of pyrophosphate. So pag umalis siya, magkakaroon ng positive charge. So this positive charge is attacked by the double band right here. No? So, pag inatak siya ng double band, nagkakaroon ng ring. Kaya lang meron pa rin positive charge doon. No? So, if you, have, if you have a hydrogen, nakita nyo, imagine nyo. If you have a hydrogen right here, no? if you have a hydrogen, so that hydrogen is a band. So, yung band na yun, it contains electrons. So, pag pumunta yun dito, naging pi band yun, kasi may positive charge, you will have lemonine. Nagkakaroon ng double band dito. No? And then, syempre ito, you have H+. So bahala na dyan yung biological system kung saan niya dadali ng H+. Pero you have the essential oil, the lemon. Ano? <clears throat> Meron pa yung isang course kami nung yung uh, elective, ano may elective, yung mga natural products. Yan si namang ano, mga natural product scientist yan. Si namang, si mam Joy. Si namam Joy. Basically, they, they just extract uh, plant materials and then they try to find some unique unique uh, uh, species, chemical species from, from plants. So, ini-elucidate lang nila yung structure. Actually, karamihan yung mga nakikita dun are terpenes. No? So, kasi bawat plant, meron silang mga unique chemical species. Ganun, ganun yung kwento nun. And then, Ano bang application? Actually, yung mga unique chemical species na yun can be, can be ano, active ingredients of drugs. No?
Yung iba, madaling isintisay sa laboratory, pero yung iba talaga medyo complicated. Yun yung extract lang talaga sa plant materials. <clears throat> okay, so geranyl pyrophosphate becomes myrcene. Myrcene is isolated from bay leaves. Ano ba yung bay leaves? Yung nagluluto. Kasi nung may alam ng bay leaves. <clears throat> yep, very good, Ibita. That's laurel, ano? So, yung laurel, meron siyang mercine. So, this is mercine, ano? Okay. Bay, bay is laurel. <clears throat> Kaya yung ibang properties ng mga laurel, di ba? They have, they have mertran. So, yung mga, I think yung mga, yung, they call the, ano, the, Condominium near Litran as parang bay, bay sweets, parang gano'n. <laughs> Kasi the English of laurel is bay, you know. Anyway, you, you, can, you can find uh, mercine in, you know, in laurel leaves. Di ba pag nag-adobo kayo, no? do, do, you, ano, do you taste the distinctive flavor of uh, laurel leaves? Nadidistinguish nyo ba pag yung adobo ay may laurel o wala? Now anyway, whether you taste it or not, I think this this things this thing are ano, healthy. <clears throat> so sabi ko nga sa inyo, pag pumunta kayo ng LB, kain kayo dun sa ano. Try, try niyo yung ano. Uh, hindi nga lang talaga siya ganun ka mainstream eh, yung Herb Republic, hindi siya ganun ka mainstream. Pero pag medyo mature na naman yung taste bud nyo, kaya nyo yun, kaya nyo kainin yung mga pagkain doon. Yan lang yung pag medyo sweet tooth pa rin kayo, uh, baka, oh, baka hindi nyo masyadong ma-appreciate. Pero kung medyo mature na naman yung taste bud nyo, hindi matanda na, <laughs> probably you can, you can appreciate Herb Republic. Tapos, pakiramdaman nyo yung sarili nyo. Tingnan nyo kung yung sinasabi ko ay psychological lang or talagang ano, meron talagang... Uh, positive health effect pag marami kayong kinakaing uh, herbs. No? <clears throat> okay. So, merong mga acyclic monoterpenes. Yung tinignan natin kanina, uh, ito, ano? So, cyclic siya, ano? Meron siyang ring, ano? Yung lemonine. So, merong, meron namang mga acyclic. Ibig sabihin walang ring, ano? First, mercine is acyclic. And then, the other acyclic monoterpene is cetronilal. So, this is a terpenoid, ano? Kasi may carbonyl carbon siya sa dulo. Yun, acyclic mono, monoterpene, cet cetronilal. Cetro cetronella. Di ba yung cetronella, yun yung... Di ba yun pag ano, parang nilalagay na lotion para hindi kayo kagatin ng lamok? Cetronella. Pagaling din yan sa parang grasses. Ano? Grasses din yung cetronella. <clears throat> Dati kasi, kung, kung ngayon yung mga thesis... Di ba yung ngayon, puro mga thesis, puro mga adsorption. I don't know. Man. I don't know. I don't, I don't, I don't. Personally, I don't like those thesis. Mas gusto ko pong mag-extract mag na ka lang kayo ng essential oil tapos i-quantify nyo. Tap. Parang mas ano pa, parang mas may pupuntahan pa. Kasi pag tinanong mo yung mga nag-thesis nag, ano, nag ng mga adsorption, so pag na-absorb na yung pollutants dyan sa plant material, anong gagawin nyo dun sa plant material? How we're going to dispose it? Nandiyan diyan pa rin naman, hindi mo naman yun pa rin naman yung form ng ano nakulong lang siya doon, no? What are you going to do with those plant materials? <clears throat> Lalo na yung sa mga heavy metals. They are not processing the ano, the heavy metals. Yung pa rin sila, ions pa rin sila. And then so store mo ng store yun. Eventually maglilik din yun eh. 'Di ba kasi nag nagdi-decompose ang ano, biodegradable ang mga ano eh, mga plant materials eh. So maglilich yun. Diba? Eh, samantalang pag chemical treatment, talimbawa yung mga uh, yung alimbawa, you're going to treat um, you're going to treat uh, lead chemically, magpe-precipitate. So pag nag-precipitate yun, uh, kunti na lang yung volume niya. No? Diba? Mas, mad mas madali siyang bantayan. Anyway, yun kanya lang siguro ng ano. Eto, eto talaga, pag, pag naka-extract ka ng essential oil, ang bango-bango. Tapos, pag, pag, di ba, pag maganda, pag mabango, ma maano yung market niya eh. Mabilis siyang i-market. Eh, yung, yung mar market ng absorption, nung mga absorption ano, technology, hanggang, hanggang ngayon, alam ko, wala pang commercial yun eh. 
natawa nang kalang talaga sa industry kasi alam na alam ng mga taga-industry ang dali-daling i-treat ng heavy metals. Anyway. <clears throat> ito, ito, I think yung mga essential oil mas maganda pa tong i-thesis. Kesa yung mga environmental adsorption topics. Per personal opinion naman. Probably hindi ko lang talaga nakikita yun. <laughs> yung side nila. <clears throat> And then we have the bicyclic monoterpene. So pag sinabing bicyclic, dalawang, ano, dalawang rings. So ayan, as you can see, we have beta penin and alpha penin. No? Di ba? Kuha lang kayo ng pine tree. Tapos, ah, uh, Steam distillation setup. May nabibili rin namang steam distillation setup, di ba? Ganda ganda nito kung meron kayo sa bahay. <laughs> diba? Steam distillation, hindi naman delikado yun. Eh. Di ba? Ano lang naman eh. Di ba? May maliit ka lang namang hot plate lang naman yun eh. Tapos round bottom plus. Then you can, you can I don't think a, a condenser is that expensive. <clears throat> I think it's available in Shopee. Ganda nga ng Shopee eh. No? Ito open sa flat sa pano. Uh, thing that we can buy easily. <clears throat> Alam ko may condenser sa Shopee, di ba? Is, uh, you, can, you, can, you can easily accept this essential oils and then quantify it. Ito nga pala, alala ko. Pag pala, next, next, ano, next year, ito pala yung papatisis ko. Parang na iba na yun. <laughs> so, geranil, this is your, post. you start usually with geranil, ano? So, what happened in here? <clears throat> So yung kanina kasi may parang mga SN1 no no kasi naglilibag yung pyrophosphate. This one ito parang SN2 siya ano. So as you can see the the cascade of the electron no. Di ba? Um this pi pi band no attack that carbon tapos ito magmo ito do sa kabila and then maglilib yung ano pyrophosphate no. So in effect you will have this tapos may positive charge dito ano this ring So, may positive charge. And then the pi electron attacks this uh, positive charge. So, yun. You're going to have a parang basketane. Ano? Parang basketane. You, you remember basketane in PCAM? Yung may ganun compound sa PCAM. This is a bicyclic. It means, ibig sabihin, you have two rings in one, mono, in one monoterpene. Your alpha penin and beta penin. <clears throat> yun yung kasing part dito na mag... mag i mag extract ka tapos i-identify 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 mo yung ano yung yung terpene that's that's chemistry pero yung halimbawa mag magdi-distillation ka tapos i-quantify mo yung amount i think that's ano that's chemical engineering di ba do you agree so pwede pwede din precision ng chem eh tsaka you're not going to use Uh, complex equipment ano Med medyo complex yung ginagamit nila pang ano eh pang determine ng structure di ba yung ano ba yun <clears throat> hindi siya pang KMN ayan right. cisketerpene cisketerpene consists of ano three isoprene units and have the molecular formula C15H24 so example of cisketerpenes are and cisketerpenoids include eumolin ito yung sa bira no parnesins and parnesol So Siski the prefix the Siski prefix means one and a half. <clears throat> so ang interesting na kwento dito, I don't remember kung anong year pero parang nasa MCL na ako noon eh. Siguro mga 2016 or 2014 ano. Yung nanalo ng Nobel Prize is taga China tapos yung compound is artemisinin. So artemisinin is a Siski terpene. Ibig sabihin it's a 15 carbon Ah, uh, yung, yung structure niya ano, ah, uh, cisky terpenoids. So ang istorya kasi nung merong Cold War between China and US, binan ng US yung importation ng China ng ng gamot sa malaria. Ang dami nagkaroon ng malaria sa China. Kasi familiar with malaria. Yung nagchichil pag nakagat ka ng lamok tapos merong merong ano, yung causal organism niya is Basta basta nagki-chill tapos mer fatal din siya ano. So merong 1000 year this is the 1000 year old book. Nakalagay doon sa 1000 year old book uh, this particular plant pag binoil yung Artemisin anoa tapos pinainom mo yung yung liquid yung pinag-boil pinagkuluan. 
nakakagaling siya ng lagnat. Nakalagay dun sa ano, 1000 year old book. So, ganun yung ginawa ni ano, ni Tuyuyu, no? Ni Tuyuyu. Hindi ko kasi makalimutan. Siya daw yung siya daw siya, that's that's the that's the lady who won the Nobel Prize. And I think 2008, 2016. Siya daw yung pinakamahirap kantahan ng Happy Birthday kasi ang pangalan niya Tuyuyu. <laughs> Hindi ko nakakalimutan yung pangalan niya. Happy birthday to you, you, to you, you. <laughs> Something like that. Ano? <clears throat> so, as you can see, the structure of Artemis in right here. No? Uh, so, ganun yung ginawa nila. They, they boil Artemis in. Tapos, they, they let it ano, taken by the ano, yung mga malaria patient. So, nung una, bumababa yung lagnat kasi nilalagnat din pag may malaria. Eh. Bumababa yung lagnat. Pero eventually, bumabalik. So, hindi talaga napapagaling. So ang ginawa nila they they ano they use chemistry technique kamukha nung ginagawa natin sa organic chem ano so after boiling they they use a set panel tapos in extract nila ng ano ng chloroform chloroform pa yung available noon wala pang dichloromethane so in extract nila ng chloroform tapos tinanggal nila yung chloroform tapos yung mga yung tablets yung tablets yun yung 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 active ingredient yun yung pinainom nila and eventually gumaling sa ano gumaling sa malaria So ang kwento kasi ng Nobel Prize this particular medicine saved parang ano 1 million 1 million Chinese from from malaria approximately 1 million that's why two years given the Nobel Prize in 2000 so, paka check na lang basta 2000 something <clears throat> um, pero 1970s pa yon during the ano, Cold War <clears throat> yun yung istorya ng ano ng artemisinin. And then, apples. Merong apples ay may parnisin. So this is parnisin. Ilang carbon to? 15, ano? So this is another cisquiterpene. Ayan kayo ng apple. Ano, yung balat niya, yung balat niya, meron yung parnisin. I don't know kung yung mga ganitong apple, yung ganitong karerad na apple yung may parnisin. Ito yung nasa picture. <clears throat> Diterpenes. So diterpenes, this is 20, ano? 20 carbon terpenes. So example nito is vitamin A. So ito yung vitamin A ano, sa picture. You have a ray, then you have a straight chain. Tapos meron a hydroxy group. So diterpenes are composed of four isoprene units kasi nga C20. And of the molecular formula, C20H32. They are derived from geranil, geranil, pyrophosphate. Di ba yung ger geranil 10, ano? Tapos another geranil, another 10. So that's 20. So examples of diterpenes and diterpenoid are capistol, cowyol, sembrin, and toxidem. No, precursor of taxol. Taxol is a drug, di ba? Okay, I, I think this is a cancer drug. <clears throat> so diterpenes... also forms the basis of biological important compounds such as retinol, retinal, and phytol. So yung retinol, vitamin A yan. No? So, kung nag-industry na kayo, pag test din kayo ng vitamin A, lalong lalo na sa Pilipinas, no? karamihan ng mga companies dito ay um, food companies. We only have one minute, so mapuputol to, tapos connect na lang ulit kayo sa, ano, ha? sa Zoom. <clears throat> Do you have any questions, concerns? Diterpenes, 20 carbons. So stop ko na lang ha, parang hindi ba iba-iba. <clears throat> 